Hello, I'm Jay Ford, the beer review guy. I've got a beer from Vortex Brewing, Vortex Alley, sorry, Vortex Alley Brewing. Um, David, uh, that works there, gave me some to review. Gave me four of them. Uh, I think I got, this is my third one. I got one more after this. So this is, a, a, first off, it's, it's a cold evening so I thought this would be a good time to review this. Uh, it's 54 degrees probably feels like 53, 52 somewhere around there but it's cool out so I don't know how many more cool nights we're gonna have so I thought I'd take advantage of and do this and the porter sounds pretty good. This is a chocolate actually this is a stout. This is a chocolate raspberry coffee stout. I thought that sounded really good. 7% ABV uh, Vortex Alley Brewing is out of Ponca City, Oklahoma. Let's see. So the name of this is From Russia with Love. Does that sound familiar to anybody? I grew up watching all those 007 movies. Um, so I thought this was a pretty cool name here. Okay, I've had this set now for about 45 minutes. Probably closer to 50 minutes. It's how I like my stouts and porters. So I like them not ice cold, more closer to room temperature than anybody that's got, you know, a lot of uh, experience with porters and stouts know that you get more flavor profiles when it's not as cold. So... Wow, that's, that's really dark. Wow. And that's a real rich looking head there. I mean, it's very sudsy. A very, um, let's see. <clears throat> a very chocolatey colored head. Oh man, that smells so good. Wow. So you get milk chocolate and you get a raspberry aroma in there too. Smells pretty sweet. You get a, a light coffee on, on the back end of this aroma. For me, the first thing I get is the, the milk chocolate. Wow, that smells really good. <clears throat> it's keeping about a three finger head. Very, very fine, frothy head. It's just, it just screams rich, just richness. It just looks like, I've described these heads before like that in the way of that, um, like a Ruger float kind of, you know, float head. <laughs> uh, Yeah, that's just, it's really, it's really dark. It's, I'd say close to motor oil, but I'd have to be more specific and say close to used motor, motor oil. Motor oil that has 300,000 miles on it or something. <clears throat> Man, it smells good. Okay. I'm ready. You guys ready? Wow. Okay. 
it's got like a, a a mix between a milk chocolate and dark chocolate on the taste. You get um, a, 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 um, like a, a baker's cocoa um, bitterness on the back end. Uh, you get a coffee bitterness in there too. Very roasty. Um, sweet up front, bitter on the back end. Um, you get that raspberry in there. It's kind of It's up front there. Raspberry kind of blends out a little bit. Um, and it kind of uh, is replaced. The raspberry is replaced with uh, that bitterness on the back end fairly quickly. It's got a... It's got a full body light carbonation. You get that 7% alcohol just a little bit. Um, <clears throat> but they did really good with representing the name i mean what kind it is it's a chocolate raspberry coffee stout you get all those flavors in this i do feel the love but i don't i don't get the sensation that i'm in russia so that i can't say is showing through. No, that was stupid. So, <laughs> did I say it's 7% ABV? Yeah, I did. It's really good. It's really good. Okay. The artwork is, is pretty cool on here. It's, I don't know if you'd call it abstract type art or not. <clears throat> I think I actually have this movie. I've got like six or seven James Bond movies. Oh, there's, yeah, there, I didn't even see that till just now. It's James Bond right there. Okay. Really good. Really good style. Oh, excuse me. All right. If you live in Oklahoma or you can uh, come visit Oklahoma sometime and you're visiting places and you want to swing up by Ponca City, take a look down there, run by there, run by there and grab some of these. I don't remember where all they distribute their beers, probably a lot of them in our local liquor stores here in Tulsa. Um, so check it out if you run across it. And uh, yeah, I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. Thank you to David for um, giving me these. I'm looking forward to um, checking out the last one I got in there because they've all been really, really good. And uh, yeah, we'll see you all on the next one.